Hi everybody, Richard Michael Owen here at the Arms Sotheby's Auction in Monterey and I'm looking at one of the world's best E-types. It's called the Blue Diamond. It was restored by Classic Showcase. It's a 100 point concourse restoration car and uh, it's really, really, really amazing. Yeah, just taking in the lines of the car first before we go in and have a real detailed look at what makes this car different from a lot of the other cars that I normally work on. So it's a light blue metallic with blue interior. You can have a look at the interior here with the light blue bucket, bucket seats, sorry. Just perfect seats, I love it. See so a steering wheel there on the dashboard. Brilliant. Just go around here. Yeah, loving this car. So it's a really early car, 1961, outside bonnet latch. There's a lot of things that make this car different from the later production models in 1962. I'll just show you a little. I don't know all of the differences, but one of them is this little piece of rubber up here. Another is this small relief in the chrome. I don't know if you can see it. That's because these door panels are two-piece rather than one-piece. Yeah, wonderful car. Look at the metallic here. Classic showcase there here in California, and they do a top level job. Really loving the blue diamond. Here's my friend Jason. Hey, Rich. You want someone to open the hood on you? Yeah, let's have a look yeah. to see what we got under the hood of the blue diamond. There's a latch in the middle there. Make sure there's nothing up front here. Yeah, that's good. The latch in the middle, dude. There we go. Look at that. So there's. Diamond. You don't just whip the hood open. Do you? Yeah, right. Do it with yeah, care. Look at that engine bay. Wow. Really digging that pumpkin cylinder head, porcelain manifolds, early brake reservoirs. Holy. You know what I really like about this is the original data plate. They didn't stamp a new one and made it all shine new. The data plate's nice. Tina on it, and it looks original. Let's have a look. You know, yeah, right. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, so this is an original plate. Yeah, right. And it looks really good, which shows what an awesome car this was probably before they restored it, right? Holy, look at this. So much to take in. Wow. You got the early linkage, adjustable linkage, like the XK150S. Loving that. Kind of see what the linkage looks like there for the outside bonnet latch. Now, these... Hoods are supposed to be welded. I don't know if you can see any spot welds there or not. Welded where? Instead of bonded to the outer skin. Oh, these guys here? Yeah. Uh, nope, they're spot welded right the there. Spot, you can see the spot. Can see oh, that's the louvers, welds. but the whole the hood should be as well. Um, yeah, it's here too. They're there, there too. That stuff's all spot welded. Oh, nice. Oh, okay, right. So, uh, Brilliant. You know. Nice. I like how they do this little detail too. See that? Boom. That's a little... Uh, oh, he's talking about how they fold boom. this... Fold these guys over. I can't, do, I can't yeah. see it over here. And now continuing on, look at the plenium and kind of a uh, painted silver. Got the can here in black. Wow, look at the presentation on this thing. It is absolutely superb. It's sitting on bias ply tires as a top level car should be. I think Arm Sotheby's did sell this car a number of years ago. So for 440,000. And they're looking for 400 to 500,000 for this. Reading between the lines, they're kind of looking for 450. It's probably where the reserve is at. Yeah, really loving this car. Got the Lucas battery, loving that. Early voltage regulator. Holy, what a spectacular piece. Yeah, classic showcase, really know what they're doing. Look how clean it is in the fender well area here. Got the correct radiator. Yeah, all the details are correct. Love the porcelain manifolds. I mean, just look at the paint job on the uh, heater box here. It's beautiful. These guys really know what they're doing for fit and finish. Got the early heater box with the large aperture uh, vent there. Yeah, pretty incredible. 
Lovely. Well, we better put this down so everybody can appreciate the beautiful lines of the blue diamond. And that does it, yeah. For my review of uh, this wonderful car here at Arms Sotheby's, really digging it. Hope it sells for uh, all the money. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you, everybody.